All right, this is One Last Midnight. Welcome back to another episode of Timberborn. And there's been a major update. You can see that we've got some issues going on here. Or since the last time I played, there's been an update. So let's look at the update because this is kind of interesting. So they added in this concept of irrigation and water. So you have to manage your ground. You can see it's dead, it's died off. If you don't have somewhere to water the ground, uh, you're not gonna be able to plant. And if you, well, you can plant, but your plants will die off. And so there's, they gave us a couple new items to manage that, which is a water pump, which we had before, uh, a new building, an irrigation tower, and a new building, a small water tank, which costs no research to unlock, but you can get that right away, which you're going to have to do to be able to save our plants. I don't know if we're going to be able to save our plants or not. It's going to be kind of interesting. Uh, there's droughts. So now there's a wet season and a dry season. Uh, the concept of ruins and metals, they added a new scavenger and there's some new resources. Uh, metal, which you can collect from ruins. And I was wondering what's going to happen with the ruins. Uh, there's metal related changes. Um, you get some platforms, a printing press, an engine, a carousel. Uh, a tribute to ingenuity, which I, I think is probably like a, a statue or something like that. Explosives. An explosives factory, so you now can produce dynamite and uh, blow up parts of your world. Uh, there's been some changes to the maps to be able to view the uh, irrigation uh, and the drought related areas. And uh, there's also been some major visual changes. And so that's pretty huge, right? I mean, there's a there's they did a holiday stream as well, and then they did some bug fixes. So I came in and I'm like, what's going on? And we're immediately gonna have to put down this water well. Now they said that the small water tank, they said that um, I should really start a new game. And yeah, I don't quite feel like, let's just try it. If it breaks this save, what I'll do is, I guess I'll start again. I'm not entirely sure. So let's see how this whole thing plays out. I'm gonna put this down. I'm I'm going to hopefully see that there's nothing else being built and they will pr prioritize this. Pr pri uh, and that they will build this building. Okay, I'm starting to get watered. Actually, it's very interesting. Okay, so the... Ah, uh, I see what's going on. Hold on. Proprietize, that's what I was trying to say. And it's very interesting, near the river, it automatically, I've got some radius of goodness, right? So the trees are, they're kind of not okay. So this new water well, should I actually put it up here so it'll be ben more beneficial? Because this is, this is going to irrigate this whole area. Let's look again. Let's look again. If I put this water tank in this area up here, I think that would be better. Let's do that. I'm going to put the water tank here. I'm going to get rid of this water tank. And now we're going to move. Uh, let's put it seven speed again. And this guy's not happy because of what? No tree in range. Okay, well, there's trees, but they haven't grown yet. This guy's still planting away. These plants are going to die off in a day and a half-ish. We do have water. Water went down really fast. Which I thought was kind of interesting. How much water are we going to need to have now to be able to manage... I don't know. This this whole thing is going to be pretty fascinating. See how this whole thing works out. We've got this guy building. Okay, he's building. Uh, he's going to wind up storing water. They're storing water in there. Now, how does that irrigate... Oh, he's dried out and died. Great. Wow. 
I mean, I guess that just allows the beavers to get water, right? It doesn't help with irrigation. What does this say? Does it say anything? Stores a small amount of water. That's it. My irrigation tower takes 200 science. Wow, I last I lost part of these crops. This is gonna hurt, actually. Look at that, I have no water. I am down to three water. I, they did drink water out of here, so... I'm surprised you can't get more than one person pumping water. You should have more than one person pumping water. We're going to be hurting for food until I can get the science up and get irrigation going. There's really nothing I can do about that. This beaver's planting away. He's within the radius. He's going to plant all of these trees out, which is good. This, these trees are going to take time. We cut all these trees down. We wood wise. Uh, I guess we're okay. All right, logs. We have twenty six logs. If that, I'm reading that correctly. And these beavers can cut a little bit into this area, but not much. I, I'm glad that that doesn't. Oh, the trees actually die too. Holy smoke! That is rough. Sorry, I'm just looking at this. That, that is really rough. That's really going to change where you would set up. Well, you're not really de deciding where to set up your land. Though, are you? I mean, so they're really saying, hey, look, you should think about cutting a river through your land. How is this going to work? I'm very curious to see how this whole thing is going to play. This is a pretty small map, to be honest with you. We might have to start a new game just to see what happens. Because I don't know if this water well is working the way it's supposed to be working. I mean, do we have people saying they're thirsty? Why is this guy saying he's thirsty? Well, he took forever to take a drink of water. I'm a little confused on what's going on here. A lot of changes to the game. I like to see, I like the fact that they're working on stuff. I, I mean, I'm very happy with the fact that they're working on stuff. I'm very excited about that. This guy immediately replants it. Good. So we'll have trees coming in on a steady basis. They are harvesting some of the food that is coming through. I, I mean, I still have berries, but berries are seasonal. They're using up the berries right now. I'm re Okay, I finally got 200 science. Let's unlock this irrigation tower. How big is this thing? Wow. It doesn't irrigate a whole heck of a lot, does it? And you'd really have to plan where you're going to put this. Like here is optimal, right? But that's right in the way of my farmhouses. I'd have to get rid of my farmers. How much is it to build a farm? 25 logs. Why am I going through logs? Ah, because of the planks and stuff. Let's turn these guys off. The planks, the gears, all of that. They're eating up logs. Okay, I got rid of those guys working. Water is a serious problem. Can I build some stairs? Here? Let's build some stairs there. Hmm. What am I going to do? I 
Because if you start a new game, right, you would... You would change the location of where you put your initial housing. You would stay in this band. Hmm. All right, let's think about this. Let me get rid of one farmhouse. Do I have enough logs? I don't even have enough logs to rebuild it. That's going to be problematic. So they did build stairs. Can this guy go up the stairs? He can go up the stairs. Perfect. Let's get him to cut down some of the trees. All right. We'll set that for chopping. We'll get them to chop down these trees. Are these maples? No, they're birch. They're like the lowest of the low trees. Yeah, the birch are the fastest growing, but the least producing tree. And we can harvest some of these trees. These guys should go up here and chop down. Yeah, they are chopping down the trees up here. Good. I was a little concerned about that, but they are cutting down the trees. And forestry now, I can because I built the stairs, I can plant up here. So I probably should think about planting. I'm thinking just birch. I just plant birch up there. Since it is watered, let's do that. Since it's the fastest growing. Let me plant birch here and here. Okay, that's going to keep that guy super busy. And let's just make sure that I am cutting all of it. I cut this whole area up here. Good. Okay. All right, and we'll have some lumber start coming back in. Logs are coming up. Let's demolish this farmhouse. And in its place, put down the irrigation tower. Which will cover the entire radius of my foods. Yeah, you know, I could change... Can I change the way that the farmhouse is positioned? If I get rid of some roads, I can change the way that the farmhouse is positioned. Yeah, I'm going to do this. Okay, we're going to see what happens. And let's demolish off a couple roads. Let's see, let's uh, get rid of this road here. Oh, I want to delete buildings. I guess that's housing too, right? Yeah, let's get rid of that road. And let's get rid of this road. And, ow, if I get rid of the farmhouse. I don't want to get rid of both farmhouses, but I'm going to have to... Just to change the orientation on them, ouchie. Okay, let's delete this for now. Let's get the farmhouse down. Yes, change the orientation like this, good. Okay, and then I can put a second one here. It's exactly what I wanted. And I could change this road a little bit and add the path right here instead, good. Okay, that works. So. What's going to be first? <laughs> uh, yeah. All right. Well, get whatever done, good boys. Come on, Beavertons. Get to work. Hey, this is crazy. This is crazy. This whole irrigation stone thing is insane. 
I need a sip of coffee to be able to go through this. I have to. Oh, that is so good. So good number coffee. I was thinking about extending out my growth area, but Oh, it, it just got it just got planted. Or it just got built. And immediately went green. So what are they gonna do with the dead stuff? Of course I need farmers. I don't have any logs. Okay, good. We built a farmhouse. Good. Let's get two farmers working there. They're going to harvest first because that's what we told them to do. And as soon as we get this second farmhouse going, we'll be okay. Water's a huge issue. We're just going to have to put down an incredible amount of water pumps, right? Is that the deal? We're going to have to double up on our water pumpage-ness? Pump that water. Pump the water, yeah. I think they changed the speed of road building. Because the roads don't look like they're taking forever. See, it's out of water already. It's going in and out of... <laughs> it's kind of psychotic. Alright, all the beavers are working. All the beavers in the house! We gotta get these water pumps built. And we gotta get beavers working there. This is crazy. This is crazy to be able to supply. Let's get rid of this building. That way they'll just focus on this. And we'll get these built up as fast as humanly possible. Oh, but that watering did not include... Oh, it didn't include these trees over here. So I'm going to have to irrigate those trees as well. Ow! I just lost half of my tree harvest, and they happen to be the good ones too. Well, that was pine, but my maple trees are... They're wackadoodle. Come on, we got another pump going? Good. I'm completely out of water. I'm completely out of water in my beaver town. I love how the fact you get water and you don't get water and it's just like it disappears. <laughs> it's like, what, you wanted water? <laughs> Zucka, you ain't getting water. That's crazy talk. Food, we're surviving. I mean, we are surviving on food. I was going to put down the mill. We should probably still put down the mill. It has to be powered though. So we would have to finish this off, but that's not a priority right now because of our water situation and our lack of logs therein. Because we have no logs right here, I'm going to demolish this building. We 
let's go harvest these logs just to get them taken care of. I mean, we have plenty of logs we can... Well, we don't have plenty of logs we can harvest, but we have... We have trees that are growing. I, I would have gotten these pine trees. I'm a little upset that I didn't get these pine trees. And I'm not going to get half of these maples. I don't... Okay, we got four pumps running. Is our water starting to be sufficient? It looks like it's starting to be sufficient. Let's see if I can build another irrigation thing. Man, that totally sucks. I'd have to put it up here. And I can't even build up there because I have this stuff planted up there. That would only get part of my trees built. Uh, and it's not like we're staying on top of the water either. People starting to go hungry. Great. We're just going to kill everybody off. Let's just kill them all off. <laughs> Let's have a beaver massacre. Dang beaver. Do I have wood? Do I at least have planks, logs or something? All right. Let's get... Let's try to get the food situation down. Let's let's build this. So I then in turn can build the grill or the mill, not the grill, the mill. Let's build the mill and then let's also build the baker. Okay. Zero water. We're, we're, we're totally out of water. So this game is in early access for those of you guys that were wondering. Or no, it's not in early access yet. It's going to be releasing to early access when? Let's look at it. It'll be releasing to early access Q1 of 2021. I'm going to have the mass beaver die off here. There's very little that I could do. Oh, I'm getting some carrots in. Okay, maybe I won't have a mass beaver die off. Hold on. I, I, I might luck out. I might get some beavers fed. Before they're dead. <laughs> Poor beaver population. All right, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to let, you know, I'm just going to do this video today. And I'm going to let it run. And then what I'm going to do is before I do the next, I'm going to start a new beaver town <laughs> and just try it out and see what happens. Dry season's approaching. Oh, great. Great. Let's just bring more pain and misery to my whole beaver population. So when dry season approaches, what happens? Does the river dry up? How does that all work? Beavers lose their mind. Okay, we have a power mill going. There's some power right there. Let's, uh, where's my power scenario? Power. And let's put a little... Oh, I have to... I have to get rid of these resources. Demolish these guys. Rock. Oh, good. Good, get rid of those. Get rid of those, Beaver Town! Beavers. Oh, do I have anybody chopping trees on this side? No, I don't have anybody chopping trees out here. I was wondering why these trees were not going away. It's because nobody's cutting them. I missed one in the cuttage. Yes, there you go. Okay, good. We'll have some uh, cut and grow, cut and grow. Cut and grow. I have a lot of people that are out of work. I don't understand why there's nobody automatically jumping on top of this. Lazy beaver. Anybody sleeping outside? Is anybody homeless? I don't think anybody's homeless. Oh, yeah, we got a couple of people sleeping outside. You know what? That's fine. It's fine, beaver. How close are we to this? 
six, uh, eight logs away. We're six logs away. Because we do have a lot of wheat stored up. We just need to get them to, to build it. Rotate that. Bing. Okay, good. We'll get the power going. Of course, I don't have logs for that. Come on, guys. You really need to cut down some logs. I mean, look at these trees we're growing over here. Get to work. Get to work. We're totally out of food. We have nothing. <laughs> no food at all. <laughs> oh, did we lose any beavers? You know, we have too many beavers anyways. I'm I'm scared about this whole dry season approaching. I really am. Okay, we have the mill done, but we still don't have logs yet. We're working on the bakery. Bakery is almost complete, and then I can start working on this power. And then once the power is done, good, we got somebody working on that. Awesome. Thank you. And then we get these all built up. They just need a handful of logs. People got to cut down some trees. I just want to see this get going here and stop seeing the little bread symbols above their heads. <laughs> Poor beavers. Maybe another cycle or two and I'll have it complete. We'll see what happens. I need more guys chopping down trees. I, I think ultimately that's what I've decided. We don't have enough lumberjacks. And even though we have four water pumps. All right, we're in the dry season. I don't know what that means. Did the river go down? Are we producing less water? What, what does this ultimately mean? Productivity is 46%. Oh, we got beavers totally dying of hunger and stuff. <laughs> All my beavers are dying left and right. Beaver down, beaver down. Oh, God. Look at that. I'm in the dry season now. Wow. Everything stops. Oh, no, there's no water at all. Wow. We need, um... Yeah, bud. Oh! They finished the mill, and now there is no water. So the mill won't run. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be a complete and absolute massacre. Oh, wait, we have some grilled potatoes. At least we have some grilled potatoes. <laughs> Come on. Get the rest of the... No, no, get the rest of the potatoes before they dry out. Oh, wow. All right, we're surviving on potato alone. Potatoes are not going to last long. Another death. Look at that. Dead beaver town. This dry season is brutal. How do you deal with the dry season? Is there a well? Am I missing something here? Water pump? Nah, yeah. Is there no well? Scavenger's hunt. Lumberjack. Paper mill. Printing press. Oh, the beavers can read. Get out of here. Beavers can't read. An engine. Inventor set, leisure, decoration, monuments. No, it would be underwater. There's no well. There is no well, people. There's a water pump, but the beavers are not smart enough to dig down into the ground to get water. <laughs> to get water. Stupid beavers. <laughs> Dumb beavers. Oh, complete massacre. 
complete and utter massacre of all beavers in Beaver Town. Beaver Town is dead, people. It's dead. We're dying of hunger. We're dying of thirst. All these beavers are toast. We don't, we're not going to have any beavers. We have two adults and one child. Three beavers left. Let's see what happens to the two beavers. One beaver, one solitary beaver left. And it's a child all by himself. Oh, look how lonely he is. Look, look, look at this poor little guy. Look at this little, where's mommy? Where's daddy? I can't believe it. I'm thirsty. What am I going to do with myself? Poor beaver. Yeah, I know. It's very sad. You're hungry and thirsty. What what happens when you have no beavers left? We don't have beaver migration, do we? At least he's got a well-being of <laughs> four. My poor beaver. Oh my god, he's got no social life. He's... Did he die? Is he still alive? He's still alive. Remarkably, this guy is... Man, he's tough. Let's keep him. Let's get him to like... No, sorry. <laughs> We're dead. There's no beavers left in our town. Our beavers are toast, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> We've lost beaver town. Well, I want to thank you guys for joining me. <laughs> On this exciting beaver adventure. <laughs> this is insane. Uh, we're we're going to try again with a new save. And I hope you guys join me for those videos. Uh, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you're, We just went to wet season. Yeah, isn't that funny? And uh, if you uh, like the video, hit the like button. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. I'd love to have you in the community. If you want to follow me on any of my social media, you can find the links in the description below. And make sure to hit that notification bell. Otherwise, you're not going to know when my beavers are dying. I'll talk to you later. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.